built a new academic building on the grounds of the Naval Academy in nearly 40 years, but that's about to change. Here come the shovels. Today they broke ground on a hall dedicated to a new field of cybersecurity. This building is groundbreaking on many fronts. ABC 2's Don Harrison was there and explains more to us. Music and excitement filled the air as ground was broken on the new $106 million cybersecurity building. This building will be dedicated to the education and study of cybersecurity in the United States. We're so excited that we have this new building which will educate our members of the Naval Academy. Dutch Rupersberger, congressman from Maryland's 2nd District and ranking member of the Intelligence Committee, was on hand for the ceremony. Cyber is one of the most serious issues facing our country in the future as it relates to national security. We're being hacked on a regular basis. Uh, we, we know that future wars will, could be involved with cyber attacks, whether it's space, whether it's in the United States or with our allies. The new cybersecurity building will be named after Admiral Grace Hopper. Hopper was a U.S. Rear Admiral and mathematician. This will be the first building of any of our military academies to be named after a woman. Another strong American female leader, Barbara Mikulski, helped get some of the funding for this building. You know, as weapons have changed and the threat has changed, the Naval Academy curriculum has changed. So now we know that we've got to fight not only on air and on water, but we've got to fight in cyberspace. This building is devoted totally to the cyber curriculum at the United States Naval Academy. These are our future cyber warriors of tomorrow that are here and will be trained to protect the United States of America and our allies. The building will be overlooking the shores of the scenic Severn River. They will begin construction shortly and they hope to have it completed by September of 2019. At the Naval Academy, Don Harrison, ABC2 News.